Hello everyone and welcome to my book Beauty Secrets. So I've been seeing a lot of Pinterest and TikToks being like, oh does anyone else pretend they're in Vogue Beauty Secrets? And I do sometimes and I was like, oh that'd be such a fun video idea. So here we are. And by no means do I have any beauty secrets. Um I just do what works for me and what works for me may not work for you but here is Lani's beauty secrets okay so first things first I'm a realist <laughs> but we clip my hair back so it doesn't get all wet because we gotta wash we gotta peel these off first Sorry, I took that off. Now we go. What's our face? So this might be controversial, but I don't wash my face in the morning. Why? One may ask. Well. A while ago, I saw a video of Salma Hayek, I think it was Salma Hayek, I can't remember, talking about like her beauty secrets on the runway. And she was like, she only washes her face at night and in the morning she uses rose water and moisturizer. And that's what I've been doing for a while and it's been working. I still have, I have pimples on my face, as you saw, but those were more so from the fact that I can't stop eating popcorn with Cajun in it but my skin hates it and I need to stop because like the same thing happens with hot Cheetos. I just, my face just breaks out when I eat it. So take a fan. And then I'm like, mm, good enough. So then I go in with my rose water toner and I go, I do a lot of spritz, which is probably why I'm running out, but I do a lot. Make sure my face is covered. And once your face is soaking wet in rose water, then you go in with the band. I can't stop quoting uh what's it say snoop dog ever since he said that because i saw a video where neuroscience was talking about how that's actually the best thing you can do in your morning get up out of bed turn your swag on um look in the mirror say hey bad bitch because that's some of the best things you can do because when you wake up the theta waves in your brain are the lowest so they're more like mm, you know it's easier to be like you're a bad bitch you do what i say <laughs> And then mirror affirmations. Oh my gosh, I loved uh, Phoebe Tonkin's like red lip beauty secrets because she talked about how she puts on the LED mask and she does a meditation manifestation thing. And I was like, there, there's more of us out there than just the ones on Pinterest and TikTok. <laughs> because I feel like I feel like celebrities definitely know about that kind of stuff as seen in her beauty video but like they just don't talk like Jim Carrey's like oh by this year I'm gonna make this much money screaming at the Hollywood sign after his shift of being a waiter and he surpassed that by the year the year that he said he was gonna make that much money he surpassed that so while I wait for it to dry a little more through the air I try to plan my outfit for today. I usually go through my Pinterest, but I'm filming on my phone. So I have to go through the Pinterest board in my brain. My little catalog. So I'm thinking I'm gonna wear this Lululemon shirt I have 
which oh my gosh so i got it when i went to the mall of america went to lululemon because i had a gift card because i was like oh like i want to try lululemon like i've heard their leggings are amazing i went there their leggings are really regular and i I mean, I can never justify spending $118 on a pair of leggings, and if you can, cool, good for you, especially if you have the money to do that, like, good for you. I'm a pro college student, so I do not have the money for that, but I also just, even if I did, I can't really justify spending a pair, $118 on a pair of leggings, um, so... Yeah, anyways, I tried them on and I was like, these are really regular. And I have this pair of Victoria's Secret leggings that my mom got me, like, my freshman year of high school for Christmas. They've held up through the years and they're so soft. People are like, oh, the lemon leggings, they are so buttery soft. And it's like, Victoria's Secret leggings, these leggings I have, so soft. They, they are actually buttery soft, not the Lululemon buttery soft that people think it is. Because it's really not that soft. But anyways, so I had a gift card and I was like, I was so disappointed. I was like, I feel lied to. <laughs> I was like, you guys are liars. And I'm a liar. It's a liar. But anyways, so I was looking around because I was like, damn, now I have a $50 gift card. What can I buy here? And I found this shirt where like, it's really soft. And it's like a light, like powdery blue with like a hue of purple in there. And it has like a twist in the back so it's like kind of open back and then like it's like a twist and like i'll show you guys when i get dressed but it's so cute and it's so soft it's as soft as people say that their leggings are but they're not anyways now we go in with my moisturizer which i have to clean off every morning do, 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 do. so now we put it on oh sorry besties this is what i use and for the rose water, I mean, any's fun, I guess. But this is the one I use. I got it from TJ Maxx. If now you know, you know. And usually I like to say my morning mirror affirmations while I'm doing this. Um, some of my favorites are Hamilton mirrors from Wait For It. Um, so I like to be like, oh... <laughs> share my secrets with you guys <laughs> beauty secrets anyways more than beauty secrets anyways so one of so i like to use the lyrics from wait for it some of them so one of them is like the only thing that i can control is myself because that's something i actually struggle with trying to control everything um capricorn regular rising maybe but so and then i am imminable i'm an original yes i am i'm a bad bitch and then i also like to use um beyonce lyrics i'm a bad bitch category bad bitch i'm the bar alien superstar mm -mm. um i don't know i kind of just use whatever i'm feeling at the moment i like to I like to feel it rather than like reading off a list because I feel like my subconscious in the universe responds more when like I'm feeling it when I'm like yes I'm a bad bitch I'm the bar I'm the alien superstar I'm the baddie she baddie she knows she's ten she bad with her baddie friends she baddie she knows she's ten um so like that's also lyrics are honestly the best affirmations too like i love to listen to just like magic by ariana grande because that is so it's so manifesto core she many she knows she did she many 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 friends okay so i'm pretty sure it's cloudy today however i have a 20 minute commute so I like to just like put my moisturizer sunscreen on my hands and especially my knuckles to keep them safe from, you know, the sun. And honestly, growing up, that was something I never thought I'd say because, well, I grew up in Hawaii and then we moved to the mainland 
but we went back and then, you know, for a while. And so I, when I was younger, I actually believed that the sun couldn't affect me. So I never wore sunscreen because I was like, oh, the sun can't affect me. And my mom was like, no, it still can. And I was like, no, mom, I'm invincible. It's that Hawaiian blood. I, and I took a DNA test because I was like, am I'm a phony? Am I a phony? Do I not actually have Hawaiian blood in me? Or am I really Hawaiian? And I'm really Hawaiian. Proud to say. Um, cause, and actually, the same DNA thing, my paternal grandmother, who we do not speak to, she is like, it showed me her <laughs> DNA. And she is 12% Hawaiian and I am 3% Hawaiian, which, oh my god, I was so shocked when I found that out. I was like, <gasps> only 3%? But you know what? It's better than 0%, so I'll take it. Anyways, so the next on our Miri Secrets is to scrape your tongue because you have so much bacteria on there built up overnight. That 8 hours of sleep I got... Oh, so much bacteria built up there like I mean eat your teeth I'm gonna make your breath sink so gotta scrape your tongue and then you gotta brush your teeth okay I'm not gonna show myself scraping my tongue or brushing my teeth because I gag a lot I have a really bad gag reflex especially when scraping my tongue actually it's kind of embarrassing because my gag reflex was so bad that the last time I was at the dentist they gifted me you know how they give you a toothbrush every time you go? They give me an infant one. And you know what's more embarrassing? It works. It really does help me not gag so much. But it's kind of embarrassing. But anyway, so for this, I used the Luxembo brand. I also got this from TJ Maxx. Because it comes with a little carrier. But it's not like plastic. So like if it's still wet and not dry when you put it in, it's not going to like condensate i don't know that but that happened to this which is also the same brand lux and willow see like the water or like that's left over from it like it condensates i hope you know what i mean anyways so i'm gonna turn off the camera for this you do not get to watch me gag while i take care of my oral health okay this is the top I was talking about, though. Now it's time to do my hair. I find it so funny that when I brush my hair, it just like gets bigger <laughs> and this hair is too thick i can't do like even with a big crop clip like this i can't do that like because it just falls out all right so i ended up putting my hair in just like a mid ponytail um will it stay this way all day probably not but at least it also shows off the back of the shirt thank you for watching lani's beauty secrets i hope you enjoyed this digital diary entry and yeah have a good day everyone